This particular work, when I was asked to consider it as a space, the first challenge was it's a stairwell and therefore how do people mount a staircase uh, was important. So I, I looked at it from an architectural point of view. It's an attempt to make a very dominant uh, room into something which is, in a sense, being built on, it's being constructed on, it's being elevated by a form of drawing. And so you start by slowly draw up the whole drawing just with pencil line. Uh, once the pencil lines are drawn up, you start to tape up certain areas. You get pastel pigments, sticks of pastel, which are very dry, and you rub them over the particular area that you're going to make. And this is massaged by hand. Uh, once you've done one, you then would cover that up with plastic so that the next one is ready to go, and so that uh, one by one they are completely separated from the other. All surfaces are kept clean. When you've finished, you strip off all that plastic, you expose the whole drawing, and uh, we varnish everything with the uh, compressor and spray gun. And um, that's it. As a student of sculpture, I was obliged to draw. Even if, by virtue of just doing it on a wall, there was a certain flatness to it all, it was always about building. I decided to call it Drawing for Free Thinking, in that free thinking is something which I think we all have the chance to think freely, no matter who you are, where you are. I, as an artist, have always felt that the freedom I have is probably the most valuable part of being an artist. I'm an abstract artist and I've always been an abstract artist and I feel that that abstraction forces you to think and look and decide in a completely different way because there are no, no small hints that you can really latch on to quickly and therefore for a public it's about looking hard and trying to make sense of what you're looking at. So the thinking element of this particular work, or the idea of the freedom of thinking, is really about a work that allows you to try and think about not just necessarily what I make, but why you're here, why is it here, and everything else. <laughs>